The worst thing that the devil can ever do to anyone is to hinder you, is to succeed in hindering you from returning the glory to God. The other day I was telling us how God deals with ungrateful people. And I said, number one, God exposes them. Am I talking to somebody here? God let the people know it was not one that was cleansed. There were ten of them, but only one came. He exposes them. Are you getting what I'm saying? Amen. And that's why I began by saying today, <laughs> how many persons this year in our <laughs> very eyes we have <laughs> seen God healed, <laughs> delivered, <laughs> blessed. <laughs> Up to this week, <laughs> sorry, this past week, <laughs> I was still <laughs> getting <laughs> testimonies from people. <laughs> My wife was telling me about one who was so excited over <laughs> the moon <laughs> for the <laughs> job <laughs> that she has gotten. She didn't <laughs> believe <laughs> her eyes. <laughs> She was full of excitement. Another one called me yesterday. I missed the call. Yesterday, usually I sleep in the money. I sleep in the money. I, I, I was sleeping. When I woke up, I saw the call. So when I was free, I returned the call. I said, I missed your call. What is the matter? He said, I got the contract. And this was the person I prophesied to a few, few weeks ago. I prophesied to him. And today he has gotten the contract. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. He asked me to send my account details. Hallelujah. Amen. He gave me my own, and I, this is my tithe. Hallelujah. <laughs> Somebody shout hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. What am I saying? God has been so good. Hallelujah. There are some they are hiding it. There are a lot of them they have been praying for prophesying to. But because, oh my God, because of the wickedness of their heart, just to come and say, Father, thank you. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Ungrateful people, they are like swines. You know, there are some things that God will do for people, not because they are deserving of it, but just because He wants to reveal to people who they are, their true color, what is inside of them. So let me do, I want to show you how this person is. If I don't do it for them, they are going to run them up. But let me do something for them so you see their reaction. You see how wicked they are, how ungrateful they are. So God will do it for them. So that next time, if he doesn't do anything more, you will not say, hey, God has not been faithful. How does God deal with ungrateful people? He makes sure they never get more. That is their, that is their last they will ever get. They may desire more afterwards, but they never get anything. They never get anything. Only those who are grateful are qualified for more. Thanksgiving to God qualifies us for more. I want to believe there are people in this service today that are qualified for more. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I've had some person say, some person wish, oh, I wish they put the Thanksgiving, they bring it closer or something. Hallelujah. It's self, ungratefulness. If you are truly grateful, no matter whatever it is that you're pursuing, you have to suspend every other thing. Come and return the glory to God. No matter the meeting, the appointment, or the traveling. There are some people this year, the only reason they can travel is because of God's goodness. God has blessed them. If you don't have, there are some people that speak to you now, they can't travel because they don't have anything. They don't have anything. They can't even afford transport. Are you listening to what I'm saying? Amen. Somebody shout amen. Amen. So the reason they travel, that's that is 
and evidence of God's goodness in your life. Somebody shout amen. Amen. Mm. Glory to your name, Jesus. Glory to your name. Glory to your name, Jesus. Glory to your name. Oh, we say 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 glory to your name. Hallelujah. 